Um, Joku Life here. Um, just before I start the video, I just want to um, shout out some guys who comment on my video, like Lil Tamus, also Google Space, and my boy Reefwell. Thank you, Reefwell, so much. So let's just um, get into the intro then. <laughs> Okay, guys, this is the redo of What If Naruto Had a Dojitsu. So, this story will obviously take place at the Uzumaki's clan base. After it was destroyed, Naruto and Karen are the only two Uzumaki's left. Well, not left. Well, Naruto and Karen were the only two Uzumaki's there at that time but the leaf ninjas only found naruto there was they were they were not sure if naruto was uzumaki was an uzumaki because his hair was black but they took him anyways to the leaf orphanage while kushina was passing by to go to the shop she saw this child she thought she, was, he, she thought he was really funny and cute, so she wanted to adopt him, because sadly Kushina couldn't have kids. So Minato realized and noticed that Kushina wanted a child, and he realized that she had an interest in this child with black hair. So Minato adopted Naruto and surprised Kushina. And Naruto was now part of their family. A whole three year time skip, and Naruto is now four years old. He was playing, he was playing with his mother until his eyes started to bleed. Kushina was a little worried about her child. About her child. Naruto was in intense pain. His eyes were his eyes was bleeding even more. Then his eyes changed from blue to pink. Kushina was worried. She realized that Naruto has awakened a dojitsu, but she wasn't sure what dojitsu it was. It didn't look like the Sharingan or the Byakugan, so she was sh she so she was not sure what it was. When Minato came home, she told Minato about his, this dojitsu. Minato asked his son, "Can you do this again?" Naruto sadly couldn't do it again. A 8 year time skip and Naruto is now 12, so that means he is now a Gany, but his team is now being assembled. In the original canon, Naruto's team was Naruto himself, Sasuke and Sakura, but this team is Naruto, Hinata and Kiba. The reason why I replaced Kiba with Shino is because if you ever think about it, Kiba is more like Naruto in a sense. He's more goofy, have, have, has a more goofy behavior. If you know what I'm talking about. The prank that Naruto was, po was supposed to pull off for Kakashi, Kiba did it. Naruto thought it was to be a little funny, so he did it as well. He helped Kiba pull it off. And Hinata, being the girl she is, she also agreed to this prank. Kakashi just fell for the prank and let it work, and he realized his team had a little teamwork, but he said it could still get better. Next morning, Kakashi told his team, don't eat breakfast tomorrow. They asked why, because he said, I said so. No one ate breakfast, and when they arrived, they told they told Kakashi told them actually that they will be doing a belt test. I have two belts. If one of you can get one of these belts, the two of you will pass. And the other one who doesn't get any bells, he will go back to the academy. The team was a little worried, but they had some teamwork. They Kakashi saw they had a little teamwork inside. Naruto knew about the bell test, so he was trying to explain to his team. 
While Hinata was listening, Kiba ran off and used a fireball jutsu on Kakashi. Kakashi dodged it very easily, and Naruto's eyes began to bleed again, like the last time when he was a child. Naruto's brain told him, you, are, you now have the ability to use fire style. So Naruto, Naruto with his instincts, ran with Kiba and used a fireball jutsu. Making the fireball jutsu bigger and making the flames go longer. Kakashi used a water dragon jutsu. And while he was pulling off the hand signs to activate the dragon, Naruto was thinking about telling Hinata to use lightning style. But for some reason, she just nodded her head when he was going to look at her. He was like, can she read minds? But really, Naruto's Kekagenkai made him talk to Hinata through her mind. Naruto used the hand size for the water dragon jutsu, while Hinata amped it with her lightning style, making it a gale style light dragon jutsu. Kakashi was impressed. Naruto's and Kakashi's, Naruto and Hinata's dragon overpowered Kakashi's dragon. But Kakashi was a little shocked that his students, um, was, you know, one of his students had the ability, had, had the ability to use three nature elements. Naruto was naturally born with wind. Kakashi knew that. Now he just activated fire, then water. He was a little confused. Then while Kakashi was still thinking, Naruto came with a, ra a water style a water and wind style Rasengan coming to Kakashi's stomach. Kakashi avoided that Rasengan and Naruto ran into a tree. Later on that time, Naruto realized he passed. He was really happy to know that he passed with his team and yeah. Also, Naruto was thinking about the adventures he could have with his team. So, this is the end of part one of What If Naruto Had a Keke Genkai. You guys need to keep safe and enjoy. See ya! I carry my heart.